Tonight at 6, a new report out tonight from home sharing platform Airbnb puts Indianapolis as the top trending American city among people who use that service. That means that people are looking at the Circle City as a top destination for a number of reasons. RTV6's Mark Mullins dug into why it's attracting so many people and how you can make some extra money off that new ranking. I think Indianapolis, you know, we've always had, we've been known as um, Hoosier Hospitality. That's That's been one of our hallmark um, qualities. Catherine LaCrosse is now making a living off renting out her four properties to travelers, including this house on the northeast side of Indy. Every weekend, oh yeah, yeah. I've, I've maybe had one weekend out of three years not booked. She is one of thousands around Metro Indianapolis turning to the home sharing site Airbnb to rent out their homes, apartments, or properties to visitors. This home rents start roughly around $100 a night, depending on the number of people staying. But Catherine's commitment to Airbnb is about more than just the money. Lucrative, yes, but more that it was fun. And it was, it, I, you know, I started meeting people and making friends and, and realizing that, yeah, that there was a need. That need has landed Indy as the top trending American city among Airbnb travelers, according to a new report released. And the Circle City ranks as a number four destination spot among cities around the world, according to Airbnb. It's that Hoosier hospitality that might be the driving force to welcoming people to downtown Indianapolis. But it's the grand scale conventions the city hosts that may be the driving force. We are such a sports minded, major event driven, convention driven destination that when you can sell out Indianapolis virtually every weekend for an event or a convention, uh, that drives the demand for not only traditional hotels, but Airbnbs. Even now, hotels and Airbnb hosts are reaping the benefits of the PRI convention, one of the more well-attended annual conventions in Indianapolis with visitors from around the world. The city has seen more than 3,400 Airbnb listings according to Visit Indy, the area's tourism bureau. Because the hotels are virtually sold out, Airbnbs come to the rescue, and we can capture that visitor spending through uh, non-traditional ways of, of people checking into the city. Uh, For Catherine... It's, it's afforded me the chance to help take take care of my kids better and be more free, you know, I, I have more flexibility in my, my schedule. Opening up her homes to visitors has helped spread the word about our growing city and help her live a better life. On Indianapolis's northeast side, Mark Mullins, RTV6.